Thanks, Pat. So first off, Ian, I mean, what a game for the team. Um, you know, what a game for you individually. Um, you had over 200 yards rushing. Um, you know, we saw you scoring touchdowns, um, you know, moving your feet in the open field, running over defensive players. Um, what was your mindset tonight? Um, I just wanted to go out there and be the best player I could possibly be. I mean, obviously, we started off terrible. I fumbled on the very first play. So after that, I just didn't want to let my boys down because my own line, they were opening up holes for me all day. I just wanted to make sure I could repay them for that. And, um, you know, you mentioned your O-line. I mean, you guys had a consistent approach with you running up the middle and then also running quarterback keeps. And, you know, you continue to do it and do it and do it and continue to be effective. Um, how much credit does your, your line deserve for uh, opening up holes for you? All of it. They deserve all the credit. They're some of the hardest working players on the team, and they do board drills every single practice. It's all they do because we have all our individual drills. So they've been waiting to, you know, they're trying to get a 1,000-yard rusher. They want a 1,000-yard rusher really bad. So... I'm just trying to help them get there. And you know, you mentioned that you did have the fumble early. How were you able to just stay positive and maintain your confidence and make some plays after that? Short-term memory. And whenever there's a bad play, just forget about it. And we're on to the next play. You can't spend too much time thinking about the last play because then it kills you twice. It's what Coach Houston talks about all the time. Don't let a play kill you twice. Well, Ian, great job tonight. Obviously, you're making plays all over the field. Thanks a lot for your time. Thank you. All right, so Coach, first off, um, you know, just coming off the win, um, what's your initial reaction? Uh, it was a great effort by the boys. You know, I'm extremely proud with how they played tonight. Uh, they faced some adversity early on. We turned the ball over a few times. You know, they came back in the second half and they they finished really strong. And um, you know, what can you say about Ian's individual performance? Obviously, you just talked to him a second ago. Um, you know, what can you say about the way he played today? Uh, Ian's been awesome. He's been a starting running back for three years. You know, he continues to grow and get better with every game, every carry. You know, after he fumbled the first play on offense, you know, I, t I just told him, hey, forget about it. Next play, you know, can't let that can't let that hurt us the rest of the game. And, and he bounced back really quickly um, and had a heck of a game tonight for us. And, um, you know, obviously, from what I understand, you're finding out who you're playing next tomorrow. Um, and, uh, you know, just moving forward, what's the team's attitude? Um, we're excited. You know, we'll, we'll enjoy this for the next 24 hours once we find out whether we're going to be playing Greater Lawrence or St. Mary's. You know, we'll get back to work. You know, we get a lot of work um, with them playing on a Saturday, a little short week, kind of having not as much time to prepare and get everything ready for Monday's practice. But we'll get after it like we always do. We'll have a great week of preparation, and, and we'll give it our best effort come next week. Well, Coach, congratulations on the win. Good luck the rest of the way. Thank you. Appreciate it. Back to you.